Sanatana Dharma is a very scientific approach towards life. Everything which is mentioned in our scriptures is very logical and well explained too. But there is one part which can never be explained just by applying logic, and that is the Advaita Vedanta philosophy. So let's dive deep into the roots of Advaita Vedanta and compare some of the commonalities and connections between Vedanta and the notorious quantum sign. So hello guys and welcome to my channel Quanta Quest. And today I am going to explain in brief the connection and commonalities between the most famous and mind-boggling experiment of quantum mechanics, the double slit experiment. So let's start off with the brief explanation of the double slit experiment to those who don't know about it. So the double slit experiment is the very basis of quantum mechanics. In this apparatus, we can see two slits or rectangular openings one millimeter apart from each other, through which light will later be passed. Next, we need a light source, which we have in the form of a quasi-monochromatic light of a single laser, whose wavelength is 500 nanometers, and a screen which is kept one meter away from the slits, on which later the final results will be observed. In this experiment, we then shine the laser, which when goes through the slits, a wave-like pattern, something like this, is observed on the screen. But if we close just one slit and then shine the laser, only a particle is observed, something like this. But how is this possible? How can light show both wave and particle forms, and that too at the same time? just by closing one single slit and because of this experiment conducted by british polymath thomas young in the year 1801 many other quantum physicists were confused during the time being quantum physics had been divided into two different sects one the people who believed the light is a particle and the other who believed it is a wave form in fact the great scientist albert einstein had been given a nobel prize for proving it to be a particle but this nobel prize only remained till the year 2012 as in 2012 stefano febroni and co-workers sent single electrons onto nanofabricated slits about 100 nanometers wide and by detecting the transmitted electrons with a single electron detector they could show the build up of a double slit interference pattern it was such that when detectors were used it showed a particle behavior but when it wasn't it would showcase a wave pattern just like the normal experiment and here is when the confusion arises and the connection between vedanta 2 according to advaita vedanta philosophy everything in this world is brahman and in fact there is a statement which supports this ideology written in sanskrit which is that brahma sat jagan mitya brahma jeevai pana pare which means that only brahman is true and this world is just an illusion and everything else in this world is not different from brahman it is when only when the observer tries to see it it appears to be real and not an illusion doesn't it sound familiar now let's go back to the double slit experiment here we see that only when the detectors detect the electrons a particle is observed but what about without a detector the waveform can be observed so in this case can we not regard the detector as the observer and when the observer which is the detector when it sees it he or it sees a particle but when there is no observer which is the detector in this case 
a wave like pattern can be observed in fact after the experiment in 2012 the experiment which was conducted with a detector a set other than the particle and the wave one arose a set which interpreted this as being the same behavior as that of the human consciousness which is nothing but in itself again brahman thank you for watching this video till the end and understanding the connection and commonalities between advaita vedanta philosophy and quantum science and to know more about such interesting connections and commonalities please support my channel because this is not the only example of such a connection between these two but it's just the beginning dhanyavadah aham brahmasmi meet you in the next video with another crazy connection till then one time